As a former fighter pilot and executive officer of the Red Arrows, Justin Hughes is no stranger to high performance. And after 13 years as an entrepreneur and management consultant, he has had an unparalleled opportunity to work with and learn from other organizations. Justin has presented at hundreds of events worldwide on leadership, high performance, decision making, risk and safety. Highlights include Europe's biggest gathering of business leaders, the Institute of Directors annual convention, and the Middle East's premier leadership forum, Leaders in Dubai, alongside Kofi Annan, Sir Richard Branson and Malcolm Gladwell. He's been interviewed many times as a thought leader and his book, The Business of Excellence, was published in 2016. You're not born driven, passionate, committed. These are behaviours and attitudes. You choose to make a commitment. You choose to make some sacrifices for the team game. There's clearly a bit more to it, but the bottom line is you choose to be a world-class team. You definitely choose to be a team player. You choose a set of behaviours that goes with the team game over a set of behaviours that are about pursuing your own agenda. The CIA have done some interesting research on this, and what they concluded was there are three aspects to a complex piece of analysis. There's data collection, there's the ana analytical methodology, and there's how we think about it. And what they realized was more data didn't always help. It made the analyst more confident, but didn't actually improve the quality of decision. So it made them better, confident for better or worse. The analytical methodologies were normally quite good. The single biggest limiting factor they found with highly ambiguous, um, difficult situations was our ability to deal with the data, to the way we think about the problem in the first place. And what I mean by debrief, it's not just an adverse event. It's about learning from experience. It's an objective assessment of team performance that is jointly carried out and owned by the whole team together with no seniority. How many people say they do that sort of thing? Very few people will feel confident enough to say, yes, I do that. Especially not in front of all your colleagues. <laughs> you put your hand up and they all turn and go, no, you don't. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> You're a nightmare. Justin Hughes will leave audiences engaged and inspired and equipped with insights which they can apply the very next day. <laughs>